Who will dare do this to a monstrous tyrannosaur? I'm just kidding. What species are you guys? I would love to make it on the menu. Dino and Dina having fun. Dino and his sister Dina took a walk at the foot of the volcano. Dina enjoys making jokes, which Dino finds are often very funny. In the distance, they saw a stegosaurus munching on grass. Look at that huge creature! Dina exclaimed. I'm going to throw a giant strawberry in his mouth and we are sure to laugh. Dina throws strawberries using her tail. The fruit cracked on the nose of the stegosaurus. The gigantic creature tightened up while screaming. I'll bet you guys in if you get caught. But Dina and Dino ran away laughing. Dino congratulated his sister. Great job, Dina. You hit the spot. Then, the two jesters saw a large creature sleeping under a palm tree. Look, said Dina in awe. I've never seen such a dinosaur. Let's throw him a ripe peach. You think he only ate plants like us and stegosaurus? Asked Dino. What can he do? We can run really fast, answered Dina. Two peaches hit the snout of the sleeping creature. Instantly, he jumped to his feet and howled. Who would dare do this to a monstrous tyrannosaur? But Dina and Dino have come a long way. He doesn't look happy. Dino panted. Dina burst out laughing. You see, the two peaches hit him right in the face. But within three jumps, the Tyrannosaurus had caught up with them. Well, shorty, you think you can get away from me? I'm just kidding. Dina whined. <laughs> I also like to joke, chuckled the Tyrannosaurus. Tell me, what species are you guys? I would love to make it on the menu. Ha, ha, ha. We are the di di Diplodocus. Dino stammered. Hmm, looks like I'm going to have a good meal, said the Tyrannosaurus. The monster is ready to devour its prey. But suddenly, he screamed. Ouch! Who steps on my tail? Guess, said the biggest dinosaur he had ever seen. Father! shouted Dina and Dino together. Ah! cried the Tyrannosaurus. I understand why these naughty children are left to do whatever they want. The father of the Diplodocus furrowed his brow and said to his children, You are being stupid again. Go apologize to this lizard and say goodbye. Oh, this is a father who educates his children well, said the Tyrannosaurus. But why goodbye? Because, said the father of the Diplodocus, I will throw you over to the other side of this volcano. <laughs> <laughs>